Hello and welcome to Gravure Cylinder Experts. I am starting a new series of videos in which we shall discuss different quality parameters of roto gravure cylinders which are absolutely necessary to ensure trouble-free press runs. In today's video we shall talk about roughness of the chrome-plated cylinder. Well what is roughness? Surface roughness is the measure of micro-irregularities on surface texture. I shall try to explain this in a simple way using the following diagram. Let's assume we have three metal blocks whose top surface is represented by pink color for sake of understanding. On the surface of block A, there are no irregularities. We call it a smooth surface. Whereas the surface of blocks B, and C, has irregularities in their surface. We call it rough surfaces as compared to the surface of block A. However, if we compare the surface of block B with the surface of block C, we note that the amount of irregularity in block B is more as compared to block C. Hence we can say that block B is rougher than block C. Now we see how we measure the surface roughness, and what type of roughness is measured. We measure RZ roughness of the printing cylinder surface. RZ is calculated by measuring the vertical distance from the highest peak to the lowest valley within 5 sampling lengths then averaging these distances. RZ averages only the 5 highest peaks and the 5 deepest valleys. RA is calculated by an algorithm that measures the average length between the peaks and valleys and the deviation from the mean line on the entire surface within the sampling length. Hence we can clearly see that RZ is more accurate information than RA when we measure micro irregularities. Now let's see how we measure cylinder roughness. Roughness is measured with the help of a contact type roughness meter. With a contact type roughness meter, surface roughness is measured by tracing the probe across the surface of the target. A Z roughness tester gives the measurement results in a matter of seconds. The chrome roughness is necessary to lubricate the doctor blade to reduce the contact area temperature to ensure the doctor blade wears into smaller fragments instead of melting, which forms bears, which we all know causes drag outs. It also keeps the contact area of the doctor blade clean, reducing defects and we get a sharp cleaner print. Now we come to the point what should be roughness of the cylinder. No single answer to this. It depends on a combination of substrate, ink and cylinder. The printer has to work closely with the cylinder and ink supplier to find what RZ value works best for him. In general, films work best with cylinder roughness in the range of 0.2 microns to 0.4 microns, while for paper and board jobs roughness works best in the range of 0.4 microns to 0.6 microns. In addition to roughness, the polishing angle of the chrome surface is also important. Normally 60 degree polishing angle works best for most applications. Nowadays cylinder manufacturers will put the roughness in the copper surface, so that the entire chrome thickness carries this roughness pattern. Cross scratch polishing is a modern and effective way of putting roughness in copper surface. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions about roughness write to me in the comments section. Please subscribe to my channel and stay connected.